everything that you purchase that is within the crafting world, including this origami cart, will ship for a $5 flat rate, no matter how full that cart gets. So. Speaking of storage and organization, nobody does it better than origami. The thing that we all love so much about it is durability, powder-coated steel and wood, and no tools needed to put it together. That's the backbone of it. This in particular is like a crafter's dream because it's gonna help you get organized in the craft room. Maybe it's your paper supplies, maybe you're a, a jewelry maker and you wanna use this, you can do it. Or maybe it's just around the house, you know, in the kitchen, in the bathroom, in the office. Whatever you need, you've got six beautiful drawers they're mesh so you can see what's inside, different varying sizes, and wood on the top. And then wheels to roll it around as you need to. And Tracy Rosa is here. Tracy, hi. Hi. you match perfectly. Thank with you. This one. I'm this digging you. those pants. Aren't these great? These are Nina Leonard. Very Nina nice. Nina Leonard. Here Look at the shelf. Oh, Thank you. I'm kind Kicking of coordinating it. too. Yeah. I love origami for the great colors as oh well. Oh my gosh. You know, let's do the colors first because we it. very this rarely have the colors. This is our gray, okay? And you can see that the gray has, um, we're calling it platinum and gray. Ooh. That gray. Gray has that beautiful wood top. You get two wood shells with this, but look at how beautiful. Look at that shot right there. I absolutely love it. Um, it's kind of like a whitewash. It looks um, yeah. kind of looks paint. It looks painted, but it's not. It's a gorgeous gray right there. Okay, so that is the platinum and gray. Over here we have our vintage bronze and walnut. So you've got that beautiful, rich chocolate vintage bronze with specks of gold in there as well. And then you've got that beautiful wood top right there. Love that. Okay. Okay, so that's the vintage bronze and walnut. Next to that, we've got black, which is gonna have the same color top as the a vintage bronze. So and that nice that walnut. Decked out for the yep. office there. Uh, oh, look at the lilac. How fun. Speaking of matchy, matchy, you know, <laughs> but look, the lilac is absolutely beautiful. Uh, little girls room, crafters rooms, I mean, beautiful. And we're pairing that with that gray wood top as well. Next to that is our turquoise. Turquoise has that light oak with it. So again, absolutely beautiful and remember origami likes to match back to other origami yes, so they all they play all, well together yes, they do I wish <laughs> my kids did all right white um this is our this is our white and it does have that darker walnut top as well um laundry room craft room um bathrooms this is going to be great yeah. and i'm loving the navy that's really that's kind of that's one of our newer ones we've paired that with the light oak and you can see that beautiful wood top on there as well you know what i need this one for in, in the boys my boys room yep. for their light um, because if I step on one more, dude, I'm going to lose my mind. I, and this is great because there's tons of drawers. There's tons houses. of drawers. And actually, we do have a demonstration that has a whole bucket full of Legos in there because you know that there are so many small parts. Nothing is going to fall through there. So, and that's why this is so great for crafting because... Listen, I'm just starting to dip my big toe into the crafting yeah. world, all right? Baby steps, baby steps. But what I have learned is that crafters don't have big pieces and a lot of big moving parts. There are small, intricate things, mm -hmm. but you lose one, the project's wasted, right. you know? Yeah. So here, because you have that beautiful fine mesh and all of these drawer options, you are now able to store everything. So with this system, you're getting two of the bigger drawers that are down here at the base, all right? And you can see how big these are, right? Nice and heavy, big, strong, sturdy drawers, gonna hold 10 pounds each. But check this out, Michelle. We've got the thinner drawers too, which I absolutely love because you wouldn't wanna have a big, thick drawer full of really right. small pieces. Yeah, you don't wanna stack too much and exactly. have to dig Exactly. Yeah, so, so keep the big stuff on the bottom. Yeah, okay. and then you know your more intricate stuff down here. So again, four smaller drawers. Now, can I ask you? Please I'm not do. seeing wheels. No. I'm not seeing oh things gosh. you have to line up in tiny uh -uh. little parts that can. No, come because off. I think we all can relate to getting a door or a drawer jammed. Yep. You know, and that's because right usually now. in these tracks there are wheels yeah. or things that need to be lined up perfectly. There's none of that here. Literally, Origami has made this the easiest possible way to. Put together a six drawer craft cart without yes. one single tool, all right? So let me show you how this is gonna come to your house. All right, it comes flat packed, all right? So all you so do, smart. <laughs> this is crazy to me, six drawers, yeah. two wood shelves. You open it up, you fold this over. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and put this in first. Okay. So we're gonna take this wooden shelf and basically you've got these little lips right here and you just put them right here on this bottom post, okay? So you just line those up just like so. 
All right, and then it's gonna line up perfectly on the other side. You swing this over, and you've got these little pegs right here that'll just marry into some holes up top. So there you go, it's going to fall perfectly into place as soon as they are lined up, just like so. And this, I noticed, we've got some big things on top. So yeah, this has a we good do. weight capacity. 50 pounds. 50 pounds. Yeah, so I want you to think okay. of um, not just your crafting tools, like your big crickets, or um, printers your too, printers, right? or your sewing machines, and all of that. I want you to even go as far as to think of some of your kitchen appliances mm -hmm. as well. Because even though we do call this the hobby craft cart, it really is our biggest drawer system that we offer with origami. So it's really great for any single room in the house. And to have the variety of sizes when it comes to the drawers yeah. is perfect. And again, I was able to put that together talking you know, for what was it, about 30 seconds. Took no time. No time you know, And you mentioned the kitchen. Wouldn't it be cool to put, let's say, your stand mixer on top and all your baking supplies yeah. underneath, and then you have your own baking station in the office? Yes. You know, maybe you're using it for all those extra odds and ends. Yeah. There's a sewing machine there as well. So lots of options. I mean, we talked about kitchen. The reviews on this oh, are crazy, so right? wild. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I had it. And I don't know where it went, but okay, here it is. Just some ideas, okay? Bedside, yep, by my bed. I use it for colored pencils and adult coloring yeah. books. Um, I love this card. It's well made and sturdy for my jewelry making supplies. Mm -hmm. So you've got the mesh so you can see what you have but nothing's falling through because exactly. it is so tightly woven. Yeah, so, so even, yeah, jewelry making. Even. So even think if your bag of sequins or your box of sequins busted open and fell in here, they're not gonna fall underneath yes. this, you know? So that's- Beads. Some, beads, yeah. all of the stuff that, if you've had a disaster when it comes to crafting and all of your stuff has spilled all over the floor because it wasn't stored correctly, this is worth it in, in gold. So full-size printers, mm -hmm. you know, we're wireless across the board, you know? So imagine being able to have your wireless printer, your laptop right here, here. Everything that you need for the office is right at your fingertips. And because it's on wheels, you can now move it about to whatever right. room you want to do and your And that's office true if you in. don't have a craft room and you like to right. work and just wheel it on in. And weight capacity, you said 50 yep. pounds 50 here. pounds on this top shelf, okay. 20 pounds on this second wooden shelf. And then each drawer, no matter if it's the big one or the small one, is going to have a weight capacity of 10 pounds wow. each. So substantial. Remember, this is wood and steel. This isn't yes. particle board. This isn't plastic. There it's nothing like that. So. We'll go through colors again for yeah. you. Um, just keep in mind, now normally this is about $170, so we took $20 off. It's on five flexible payments, and this is part of our big crafting um, shipping special. So $5 flat rate to ship anything in your cart that is part of our crafting special going on, including yeah. this. That's and this crazy. is steel and wood. Yeah, and it's, it's a great a, time to get it. Yeah, home. it's just under four feet tall, or maybe about three and a half feet tall. Okay. So great, great work level, you know? Like oh, you're if you right, wanted, look at you. Yeah, so if you yeah. wanted to do, like, if you were working on something, you know, I like to work standing up, Yep. you know, so mm -hmm. this is a great height for that. So if you're working on a project or anything like that, look at the amount of workspace that you have. You can see that it's at a perfect level, you know, I'm about, uh, with my heels about 5'5 five five today, yep. Yep. you know, so a, a great level. Today. I'm five doing five. good today. Yeah, standing tall, there. my mom would be proud. <laughs> That's the platinum, right? This is the platinum, vintage bronze, black, right here. Okay, we've got that beautiful black. And then we have the lilac right here, which we've paired with that wonderful gray. Okay, right next to it, we have the turquoise. Now, I do want to pause on the turquoise for a second because this was designed for crafters in mind. And one of the things that we heard so many from Gap crafters about was 12 by 12 paper. Mm -hmm, right. It's really hard to store. Just and a lot awkward of awkward size. It is an yeah. awkward size. And a lot of drawers, regular drawers out there, don't allow you. So what happens is this gets bent or the, mm -hmm. the sides get wrinkled and all of that. Because the size of our drawers are two feet by 13 inches, you are able to go ahead and store that 12 by 12 paper in here and you do not have to worry about anything like I, that. I love this color. This is our most limited, by the way, oh, okay. of all the colors. Um, all right. So that is gorgeous. Now, the white, nice and clean. Yes. This has been the most popular mm -hmm. item. I think because this will go with any style, no matter if you end up moving, you change your decor. Nice, fresh, clean white. Of course. And you know, I, I like this too for the bathroom. You know, remember it's wood and steel, so it will not rust. It won't chip. It won't corrode. It's so it's going to, you know, go ahead and stand up to your heat and humidity. But imagine all of your nail polishes, all of your foundations, all of your lipsticks, all of your eye makeup on those smaller drawers. Yet now um, your blow dryer can go in here. Yes. Your rollers can go in here. Your flat irons, your brushes, all of that it's in these great deep, idea. deep drawers. It's 13 inches off the wall. So it's really not a big piece of real estate 
great. Um, right. It's not gonna take up a ton of space. But it will store time. Yeah, and then up top here, you could have like a nice mirror for putting on your makeup, or it could be a dressing station. Just really a lot of options with it. And then the navy. And then the, the navy. navy's really pretty. Yeah. I love the lighter color wood that you have here. Origami, if you've never experienced origami, the reason so many of these items are customer picks is because they're beautiful to look at. They're design friendly, which a lot of times with a functional piece, you don't get the beautiful design. So that's one aspect. But I would say the biggest thing is no tools needed, yeah. no big manuals. There's no pictures with smiley faces when nobody is smiling right. trying to put these things together. <laughs> and then if you do it wrong, the quality is, it suffers, right? Maybe something's off and it's sideways and it's not as stable as it should be. And we feel like that's our fault because we didn't read the directions right and find there's right. always extra pieces left over that clearly I missed something. Yeah, you know, know if you have a couple screws left over, something's wrong. Literal screws Little. loose. <laughs> Little, right, exactly. Right? I, I always tell this story because I, you know, I had a, a chair that I tried to put together, which was similar to origami. It wasn't origami, obviously, but it was wood and steel. All right, when I was done, Okay, there were like, it took two and a half hours for one, and you know there were four. I believe it. There are nuts and bolts everywhere left over, and when you went to sit on it, it, like you, it was, nobody could sit on it except my 11 year old. It literally has a mark on it that she's the only one who's allowed oh to sit on it. Oh my gosh. You know? Don't so, do it. Don't, don't do let it. Let the stress happen. Let no. us show you how easy this is. I mean, there's no, there's not even little wheels to line up. My drawer in my refrigerator <laughs> screams at me. It screams at me and it comes off the track every time I want cheese. I know I'm in trouble because right. the thing just falls off. None of, no wheels. To, <laughs> can you tell? Furniture should not be stressful. It's supposed to make your life easier. Absolutely. And that's what origami does. Legit. Absolutely. Uh, I do want to point out oh, okay. right here, if you just because I noticed it, this is the top. All right, so this is the front. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, but when you're buying furniture, do me a favor. Check out the underneath. Because yeah. listen, we're going to skimp anywhere on quality and you know mess it up where people can't see. It's obviously going to be underneath here. Yeah. But the top is just as beautiful as the underneath, That's and it just point. goes to stand to show you the quality of origami. So again, this is your assembly. You take it out of the box, you open it up, all right? You go ahead and put that shelf in, and like I said, it's very easy, nothing fancy. You've got these little clips, all right? And you just line it up with that bar right there, just like so. Did that go right there? We go. Hold it for just you. like so. There you go. There, it's locked and loaded into place. You flip this top shelf over, which is already attached, all right? And as soon as you line up the little holes and the pegs right there, the entire base is ready to go. It's ready for fantastic. 50 pounds, yeah. right here. <laughs> <laughs> and then look, it can't be any easier to put the drawers in. Just remember that the smaller drawers go on top. You'll make that mistake once, because they won't fit. And then, <laughs> all right. <laughs> then so while you, while you load this up, let's go to the phones, because Ooh, we yay. have a phone caller right now. Um, I want to welcome you into HSN. You are live with Michelle and Tracy. Who are we speaking with, and where are you calling from? Um, my name is Karen. Hi, and Karen. I'm calling from uh, outside of Athens, Georgia. Oh, nice. Well, I was hi, born Karen. in Athens, Georgia. That's crazy. Hi, Karen. <laughs> Are you a fan uh, of origami? I'm so, uh, no, I'm not. I wasn't familiar with it at <gasps> all. Oh, wow. You're going to love it. Yeah, <laughs> I think so. I love the, the space that it takes, and mm -hmm. I've got a uh, scrapbook room and a stamping room, and I can take my die cutting machine between the places a lot easier because I have a vagabond that weighs 18 pounds. Oh my gosh. Ah. <laughs> Yeah, this is gonna be awesome for that. Cause you know, like I said, that top shelf is gonna hold 50 pounds worth of weight and that second shelf holds 20 pounds. And let me tell you, Karen, you're gonna be so impressed with the wheels on these two. Yeah. We get so many compliments saying that, cause you know, we get so used to the grocery store wheels, like those rickety ones that, <laughs> that never go in the right direction. These things, right. um, these are wonderful.